Hi, I'm Stella. I'm Kadeem. And I'm Ivana Sanya. And we're with Black Star Magazine, and we're doing a segment called What's Going On. In this month's segment, we'll be talking about the upcoming elections, what's important to the students here at Emory and across Atlanta. These issues include what issues are important to you and whether or not they're registered to vote. For many of us, it'll be our first time voting, so we want to see what people think is most important in this political season. So let's hit the streets. Hey, I'm Alex Selby, and I am a senior in the college. I'm Sarah Faber, and I'm also a senior in the college. Okay, my name is Tyler Stratton. I'm a senior here at Emory, majoring in sociology and minoring in predictive health. My name is Kevin Satterfield. I'm a sophomore, and I'm a business administration major. I'm Carlos Fernandez. I'm a junior, and my major is political science. <laughs> I'm Lauren Diaz. I'm a junior, and my major is political science. Hi, my name is Adrian Billingsley, and I am a graduate student. So what political issues are important to you this uh, upcoming election? Um, for me, one of the most important um, issues in this upcoming election is definitely health care reform, yeah. For me, it's um, women's issues, birth control and abortion, and having the freedom to do what I want with my body. Oh, I intend to be a doctor one day, so I think health care reform is pretty important to me as it could affect my future career as well as my health. This is Candace Page. I'm a junior and I'm a women's and gender studies major. This is my first election, so what's really important to me is health care. Um, one, because of personal family reasons. I have a lot of family members that have serious health issues and that's, it's directed towards what is going on in health care today. I'm a junior in the college. I'm an English major, African American studies minor. And I'd say the biggest issue for me is health care. Considering I have a grandmother with cancer who has been in and out of the hospital for the past two years, um, I'm all about making sure those who can't afford health care have a system in place that will allow them to get some form of health care. This is important. Um, and that's something I feel like isn't really addressed as much as it should be. Could you uh, talk about maybe why these issues are important to you? I yeah. just, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I just feel like the progress we've made in terms of women's rights um, shouldn't be set back. I also feel like no one else should be able to tell me what I do with what I can or can't do with my body. Um, for me, health care is super important just because I'm an aspiring physician and uh, the course of health care um, really dictates what, you know, how I can practice and it affects obviously millions of Americans and it's something I'm just very interested in. Um, the unemployment rate here in America um, because I'm graduating soon and I want to take a year off and maybe work before I go back to grad school. So I'm a little worried about um, finding a job after I graduate. Um, so I really want our president to have that as one of his main issues um, coming up within the next four years. Immigration is one of the major issues concerning me in this new election coming around. Why is that, Carlos? <laughs> <laughs> Because I have a lot of family in Cuba that I would like to see come over legally, you know? I feel like that would be a prominent thing. I would definitely say that immigration, comprehensive immigration policy would be one of the most crucial things to get passed um, during this election, or to talk about during this election, because there are so many uh, dreamers out there that really deserve a chance in this country, and they contribute a lot to this country, and I think we take them for granted. I would also say that um, very strong, independent energy policy would be very beneficial to the country and uh, the environment as well. Uh, definitely the economy and um, trying to level the playing field in terms of taxes and um, making sure that everyone pays their fair share of taxes. My name is Trey Garrett. I'm a sophomore in the college. I'm a political science major and an EDS minor, educational studies minor. And um, I am registered to vote. And my biggest issue right now in the uh, campaign Social uh, programs, just welfare and things like that, that are meant to kind of benefit the lower end of uh, the income bracket, especially because I come from like a lower end family, so that's big for us. All right, hi, my name is Sophie. I'm a sophomore at Emory, and I'm Claire, and I'm a sophomore also. Um, this year, I think um, definitely like um, aid for students is really important. Also, healthcare is still important, um, especially for like family members that need it. Um, I think one of the issues that are most important to me are uh, what we're going to do about um, helping those who are, uh, you know, struggling a lot in society. I think there's a lot of people who are neglected and marginalized, so I want to see what the government will do to improve processes involving them. Hi, my 
name is Amy Beth Willis. I'm a senior at Emory College and my major is sociology. Issues that matter the most to me are the maintenance of the Affordable Health Care Act, um, policy about um, taxes and raising taxes on the wealthy, um, and to help maintain the robustness of the American middle class, as well as um, policies on defense and rolling back our American role in um, conflicts abroad and advocating for more peaceful solutions. At a fundamental level, it's more about like the spirit of what it means to be president. Um, if you go back and like you look at the news reports and stuff, um, you'll see Mitt Romney said something about 47% of Americans that he doesn't count about, or that he doesn't care about, excuse me, and I feel like that's just wrong because whether you agree with how our current president has done things or not, you can argue that he's made legislation or made statements that affect us all equally. Like for example, like let's look at healthcare for instance. Healthcare is something that affects either side, whether you're black, white, Republican, or Democratic, or a Democrat. Um, if you think about um, even just gay rights and like the whole don't ask, don't tell, I really feel like that's a, a strong issue because, again, that's something that's not limited by our political parties. That's something that is, that works for both sides, you know what I mean? Like people are gonna care more about their own personal identity than what political party they're a part of. So I think in this case, the idea of like inclusiveness and how can we like really work together is what's really important in this election and that's what it's gonna come down to. Once again, this has been What's Going On. I'm Stella. I'm Kadeem. And I'm Ivana Sanu. Remember, it doesn't matter what political party you're affiliated with, it's your voice, your vote. Some real thoughts right here. This is Peter Riddick, you have a quote. Yo. My president is black, yeah. my Lambo's blue. blue. And I be in my ribs.